protection is now ready to roll. Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Uh, excuse me. Welcome back to the second Tuesday tutorials. Last time was Wind Bomb, and this time, uh, it's the Bow Spin. That's right. Uh, combat type thing, and as you could see in the intro, it worked out very well. And it's a super good thing to have in your combat. And Lionel, could you please shut up there? Thank you. So there's two types of bow spin. One, when it was first found. Uh, let me just get it. Just tap B and bow when you're spinning. The other one, it's a bit hard to do. Head, and that is actually better. And why it's better is because it, it tilts the weapon up on your back. And I will show you why that uh, is, is like good, like it helps you later on the video. But first, I want that great frost blade, so we're just gonna go. And we're just gonna do a regular one. Huh. Okay. Let's grab a loop. And if we go over here, just climb these stairs. And that's the person we want right there. So we freeze him. I just like to freeze him. Oh. Freeze him, and then we do the motion over his head. Actually, I'm going to wait for him to unfreeze. It's actually taking a while. This is gonna take some time. Now it just unfrozen, so I like to freeze them because it just makes it easier to come back and do a corner over the head bowsman. And as you can see, something's off. Uh, that it is not a Basically what it does, it keeps the enemy locked in the frozen. Oh crap, I just angled the Lionel. Oh, yeah. I, uh, So yeah, basically, how you do a bow spin is that the weapon, the two-ended weapon, is just above your head. You tap B and bow button at the same time. You don't throw it. And then, hopefully, that'll get you the bow spin. Super good in combat, I use the time. Uh, I used it in my video. Those. So that's wind bomb right there. If you want to learn how to do a wind bomb, see my last Tuesday tutorial, and you'll learn right how to do it. So, uh, yeah, if we can just go over here and uh, well, anyway, we can just use the master cycle because I'm holding my master right here, which I have. Uh, so if we just go over here, and that monster camp up there, that's where I'm going. Try to time. Go, jump, air, boom. Oh wait, I'm done, screw this. All these little so this is his other guys. I show you the Golba Coblin. I'm just gonna do the little Obosis Furies. Take care of the other guy. Lady. All we do. Also, I know he enjoys the um. Chain, and as you can see, that killed the goblin in like seven seconds. And that, to 
be fair, that was damaged. The, the cobblestone already had some damage, which is why there was another gold of cobblestone over here, undamaged. And I'm going to show you how. Also, the food it. Add this to the food it. Freeze it, and then. Actually, look, he was unfrozen, so yeah. Oh, look. I think that's. That was almost eight seconds exactly. Eight seconds to kill gold of cobblestone. That's just crazy. Like. So all you need to do, I'll show you guys once I get up there. So all you need to do, get thing out, and your head, just tap B and the bow button at the same time. You can also do it without arrows. Let me do this right here. <laughs> you can also do it without arrows. So you don't need arrows, but it's always nice to have arrows. I never have any arrows. But it is nice to have it. So the other way to do it is just when you spin it, it's get that true feature, true freeze chain that I told you guys about. So yeah, so that's all for this video. Next video, I need to show you guys how to do hit active hitbox uh, smuggling, I think it's called. Active hitbox smuggling, something like that. Or, which is good for combat and fighting guardians. Or, do you want me to teach you how to pause? Just let me know in the comments. Also, what I want in the comments too. I, I don't judge. Like, if you want me to, as long as it's not crazy, like, like BLSS to, like, T D C T O something. I will show you guys how to thunder pop rush. And that's a pro. <laughs>